Hello, welcome to JD's Prep. In this example, we're trying to figure out which equation represents a line that is perpendicular to the line represented by y equals 2 thirds x plus 1. So the first thing to remember is that when you're trying to find a perpendicular line, right, the slope of a line and a perpendicular line are opposite reciprocals. Okay. So looking at the line that was given, y is equal to 2 thirds x plus 1. This is in slope intercept form, right? y equals mx plus b. So I already know the slope of this line is 2 thirds. Okay. Because I want the perpendicular line, I need to find which one of the options below has the perpendicular slope. And again, perpendicular slopes have to be opposite reciprocals. So if my original slope is 2 thirds, then my perpendicular slope opposite would be negative, and the reciprocal would be 3 over 2. So that's the slope that I'm looking for. So automatically, I can eliminate 4, because the slope there is negative 2 over 3. I can eliminate 3, because the slope there is a positive 3 over 2. I need them to be opposites. So they have to have opposite sign. So now we look at options one and two. To figure out the slope of their lines, it's easiest to just solve for y. If I can solve for y and it's in the slope intercept form, then I can just extract the slope. So let's take option one. 3x plus 2y equals 12. I'm going to get that in slope intercept form. So I'm going to subtract the 3x to the other side which gives me a negative 3x plus 12. And then I'm going to divide that 2 everywhere. Divide by 2, divide by 2, divide by 2. So for option 1, y is equal to negative 3 over 2x plus 6. The slope of that line is negative 3 over 2, which is exactly what we needed the perpendicular slope to be. So now those slopes, right, are perpendicular, opposite reciprocals, so our solution is option one.